For more videos like this, please subscribe. YouTube, Troy Stars, Troy Stars Trucking. Now, uh, this is my first engine check like with the Mack truck. Now, um, and actually this is my first time even D-rate. Uh, this is my first time actually get a D-rate up all the way to eight miles per hour. I never get a D-rate before. But anyway, um, I'm gonna show you guys the uh, the code. It's a DTC code that comes up on the dash. And I'm gonna show you guys. Also, I'm gonna take the truck out of D-rate mode to take it to the, the a mechanic or a dealer to scan it and see. But uh, but I think it's a maybe it's a, it, it need a sensor. So um, I think that's that's the that's the problem is because this is the is the SCR system. So um, I'm gonna show you guys how to. Oh, I'm going to get out of the D-rate mode. So I'm gonna go underneath the truck and screw off the sensor from the transmission, so I can get moving right. So that's that's what I'm gonna do. So um, just some updates to you guys. Uh, screwing off the transmission and. Screen out that sensor from the transmission so I could go normal speed and that will take me to the dealer and then we will know what the code is. So we're gonna go through the code now, look at it for a minute and then we get it fixed and then I'll get back and let you go, guys know what happened, what's up and how much, you know what I mean? So thanks for tuning in, trust us, truck it. As you guys see, uh, the engine check light is on and I'm gonna go in the system, the back system at the moment See, it says STR system fault, uh, vehicle speed uh, limited to 8 kph. So, let me go in the system now and look for diagnosed and go into diagnosed. We look for uh, engine um, electronic uh, fault. So, right away, that, that, that's, that's a sensor. So, we're going to view code and the engine number this is not the code this is like a, a number 128 is for the engine so every all, all of these uh, come with a, a, a different number so we're gonna go in the engine and this is the code that is showing right now so that's the code P110286 so it's a SA16 right so as a D TC so we're gonna let us say look look into the, the owner manual and I will see the description of the fault code so I have a book in here I'm gonna look in the book also but yeah um, this is what's going on at the moment so let me I'm gonna go underneath the truck because I'm gonna do it right now making a delivery and I'm actually going really slow so yeah thanks for tuning in try start Okay, peeps, I'm on my belly. I'm under the truck. I'm basically I'm gonna screw off the sensor from the transmission. So this is the sensor under the truck, on the transmission. So I'm gonna. Uh, I don't know if I even need to pull that. Um, what do you call it? Okay, so I pull it, I pull it off. So this is the, the sensor. I remove it from the transmission. So that's all I need to do to get it by the dealer. So when I release it from the transmission, it it, it not gonna um, derate the truck anymore. So because the truck don't know the, how fast the speed is going. So with this disconnect from the transmission, the truck will, will drive the. the original way so that's what we're gonna do so that's it so we're gonna take it by the dealer and we're gonna see what the problem is so thanks for throwing it try slice truck it okay peeps so now that I screwed off the sensor from the transmission it is still saying I can't go any any faster than the 8 uh, kph right 
So I screwed it off so it cannot sense how fast the vehicle is going. So what is gonna happen is the autometer, which is this one, is not gonna move. The, the, the rest it will work, but that one not gonna move and I can go faster than, and I go, can go, I can go the top speed, I can go the regular speed. So this is what I'm gonna use to take it to the dealer to have a look at it. So yeah, so let me just move off and show you guys that I can go faster. Thanks for tuning in again. Or th thanks for still being here. Now, uh, mm, my first engine check light on the Mack truck. My first engine check light, right? So what happened? Okay, um, nothing really. I was just driving and um, I saw the orange light came on and I hear, um, you know, like a ting ting sound, you know, to alert me that. The engine light is on and also when I look at the screen I can see it is saying I'm gonna derate in 60 seconds 60 minutes right now I know I wasn't driving a whole lot because I was just basically doing like some nearby round town stuff so I was thinking maybe because the truck didn't get to drive out like drive and do the, the miles that it would this happened no what I'm saying to you guys is my I'm gonna tell you guys that the, the the code the code that came up on the dash so it is SA it's gonna be in the in, in the title by the way so you guys can see it so it's SA 16 DTC and the actual code is P11 zero two eight six right so that being said i saw this came up on the dashboard and i only i saw the code after i go in the system in the mac system and i saw the code and after that i i was driving and um it prompt me and said you're gonna shut off within 60 minutes which i continue to drive 15 minutes i was driving still then it recycled and go 180 minutes. I'm like, okay, maybe it just wanted to drive more, you know what I mean? Blow out and stuff and get to come back to what it's supposed to be. Because normally it would shut down in 60 minutes, but it, it go over that. So I said, okay, cool. So I went to the delivery. And when I got to the delivery and I checked, well, I start the truck to get off the door. And that's when I realized our power is gone, right? So that's when I had to do what I know I can do. Is like whenever the truck derates, you can screw uh, screw the sensor up the transmission, and the truck won't. Um, well, the computer won't um, or can't detect how fast the truck is going. Because it, it have to de detect that based on the transmission speed, right? So when I when I uh, unscrew that sensor, that's when the truck, that's when I could actually get to drive, you know. So I take it to the dealer because it was in D-rate mode. And normally when you go in D-rate rate mode, your filter is going to fill up because it's not blow, burning off or it's not blowing out. So the filter is going to fill up and then that's a different story. So I had to take it to the nearest dealer, which was the Mac in Cambridge and when i get there that's when i realize what i have to change so this code mean 
your DEF pump need to be replaced. Now I'm just gonna give, give you guys give you guys the price on it, like how much I paid at the Mac dealer to get this um, job done. So what they what they've done was they the temperature sensor also and a ceiling plate. I don't know what the ceiling plate is. I think that maybe is a clamp or something. But um, take a look at it. Um, so this is it. The uh okay so if you look at it it says the pump unit core so the core they take out the core for like a thousand dollars so basically the pump would have been two thousand seven hundred plus tax but because of the core um i get it for uh seventeen hundred and twenty dollars and this is not the original pump, by the way. This is an aftermarket pump, right, for the DEF. So I was told the original one was somewhere four or five, something like that, right? So this is how much I paid, and the tax is over here. So the original price is $2,600. If you look at it again, you will see um, all the stuff that they have done. So it's a pump, uh, temperature sensor, and temperature sensor is like hundred and forty dollars, and ceiling plate, thirty six, and the actual pump itself, seventeen hundred. So yeah, so that that's that's. So that's what happened with the, with the repair at the Mac uh, dealer for that. So I replace it. I get a, a, a new pump. So, yeah, you know, guys, you know, I'm in this stage. This is the stage of 700 going to 800,000. And most of the stuff on the truck is going to expire, as in do it time. And it's time to get changed. So I know all this, you know what I mean? But... I'm running the truck and keeping all those stuff in mind, but so far so good. So yeah, this is just my first engine check light. So this is all I'm going to say about this particular video. You know, if you want to know more about the truck, more about what's going on with TriStar's trucking, please consider subscribing if you're not already, right? And please leave me a comment down below what you, what's, what's your thoughts so far. Because remember, we, we, we are on a journey and we're going through this together, right? So leave me your, your thought, leave me your intake on everything that's going on. This is Troy Stars, and like I said, what good. Yeah, so this is what's going on. My background. So thank you guys for tuning in. Troy Stars. For more videos like this, please subscribe.